Yo, what is good, Sammy Squad? Back at again with another video here today. Man, we still got Chase Edmonds LTD in packs. We just got brand new heavyweights as well, 92 overall. So we're going for a big banger pull, man. We are going with the Pro Fantasy Pack today. Going to drop 500K into that because I swear to you guys, I pull the Pro Fantasies. I haven't been getting anything fire. I think my highest pull was like an 88 the last few times that I pulled it. And then I look at you guys on Twitter, LTDs, big banger pulls, all this crazy stuff like full legends, like... I need to hit one of those today. I need to get a big banger pull, so hopefully we can make it happen. Before we do get into the video, man, you know what I have to say. Make sure you guys hit the like button right now. Hit the sub button if you haven't, man, because a lot of y'all watch the videos and haven't hit the sub button, man. What the heck are you doing, bro? Just go down and hit the sub button, and also put out post notifications, man. Join the Nodi gang. Light up the comment section, and let me know down below. If you're going for an LTD in Madden 22, what pack are you guys pulling? Like out of all these packs here and the packs that aren't even in the store right now, what pack are you guys going with? Because me personally, I feel like I'm going with the Pro Fantasy. I mean, I just still feel like that's the pack, unless we're talking about this pack because this is a good place to get an LTD as well. I'm gonna still stick with the Pro Fantasy. I think it's just the best one. You guys get the most pulls from there. I've gotten the most pulls from there. So we're gonna jump into it. Uh, we'll go down to 462. Maybe 450, somewhere around that, or not 450. What would that be? Is that, yeah, yeah, 450, around 450. All right, power up. And if we get a Kyle Pitts power up, I pulled him yesterday after I was exchanging all my cards for my opening yesterday. Got a Kyle Pitts power up. Sold if I think like 139. 80 overall. Ooh, team of the week. What is it? 84 Cooper Cup, or I will take it. Man, I see that Team of the Week animation. It's just like, you never know. You never know what it's going to be. So, let's keep on going. I already got an 84 in the first pack. Love to see Elites popping out. We just need to see those Big Banger Elites popping out, man. That's what we're looking for. So, let's keep going. Rookie. A lot of gold cards. We'll take y'all. 66. All right, come on. This is where we need to hit. Most feared. 81, okay. It's an 81. We'll take it. As long as we're getting an Elite... But we need to start seeing some good ones. And also, we need to keep seeing all the gold cards popping on in the first round. Because the gold cards in the first actually does help us out a lot. So, let's keep going. Keep moving. Looking for the full legend. Looking for a heavyweight. Looking for... We'll take the high golds in the first, too. We like that. Um, Take you guys. Ooh. 85. We'll take it. So, so far we pulled, what has it been, like three packs and we got in three elites. I mean, we got in an 84, 85, 81 or something like that. So, yeah, I think 81 most feared. So, we're doing all right. Come on, EA. But, you know, man, you know what we want to say. I keep saying we're doing all right, but there's something that we're looking for. We're looking for some heat. Gold cards. Oh, we love to see that. Okay. So, we'll take all of you. All the gold cards. Those things will, you know, help us out in the end. Oh, man. First pack with no elite. Okay. We'll take the 75 overall. We're chill with that. We're going to keep on going. So we've already ripped like almost 50K in packs, man. We got to see something nice. I've been on a really bad streak with these guys. Like, I, I couldn't even tell you what my last big pull from one of these was. I think it was an 88. And it's been like that for like the last week or so. So take all of you guys. Take all the gold cards. Got a few high ones right there. Elite. 82. Eddie Jackson. Okay. So we're back to the base elites where that's like all we're getting. I feel like we're just getting strictly base elites or low elites at least. Got to figure that one out. All right, we'll take all the gold cards. We're chill with that. We have been getting a lot of gold cards. I will say that. 82. 80. Team of the week. Oh my gosh. 88 CD Lamb. Okay, so that's what we like to see. Holy elites. We got three in that round. So... We'll take CD Lamb. I think I was looking at him yesterday. He's going for like 55K. So that's not a bad pull, actually. It's an 88 overall. That's where we've been topping off at recently. So we'll take it, though. It's a big banger pull. I consider like an 88 plus like a really good pull from a pro fantasy. So I'm happy with that. We got other team of the week masters. I'd be fine pulling one of those, too, because I still have yet to get one. We also have not been getting our... Elites in the first rounds at all. 82, Legend. 83, Revis. Dang, man. Legend again. 86, Michael Vick. Bro, these Legend Trolls, man. I'm telling you, these Legend Trolls. But, yeah, I would take a team of the full team of the week guy, too, man. I, I'm still trying. That's a goal of mine. Still trying to get it. 
I might need to put a checklist of all the things that I'm trying to get. Like team of the week champion. I'm sure. What was the other thing that I really wanted to get? Um. Oh, oh, legend LTD. That's another thing that I have yet to pull still. Like I just have not gotten it. Oh my gosh, should we get gold cards in that? Holy crap, most fear. Team of the week, 87, okay. Team of the weeks are clutching up for us right now. I'm liking to see that. It's not the big banger team of the week, but it's a, it's a really good team of the week. So we'll take those and keep moving. So we've dropped about 160,000. We've gotten some pretty good pulls so far. That's the thing, the pro fantasy has been dropping us like middle tier pulls. It's just, I'm trying to get one of those 90 pluses, man. That's what I really want to see. So hopefully we can get one. Gold, rookie, elite, 82 Byron Jones. He did get an upgrade, but basically it's probably not going for too much. So we'll take that. It's not bad. As long as, like I say in all my pack openings with the Pro Fantasy, as long as we're getting like some gold cards and then like an 80 to 82, I feel like that's got to be a close to break even pack. So, ooh, ooh, there's our first elite pull. So we'll take you, we'll take you, we'll take you, and we'll take 80 Derrick Henry. Is this a double elite? Flashback. Okay, love to see that. What we got? 89 Cameron Newton. Okay, this is what we like to see. A hey, double elite pack right there with the Cam Newton. Okay, all right. Pro fantasies are doing some. We got an 87, 88, 89, 86, 85. I mean, we almost might hit the cycle here. Or what are we missing? Maybe an 83? I don't think we have an 83 pull. We pulled a Revis, but I didn't take him, so it doesn't count. We might be able to get every overall, like 80 through 89. So we just need an 83 now, which we can get. We can do it. All right. Love to see that flashback animation because I pulled it yesterday. I legitimately haven't pulled the flashback animation ever before until these last two days. So uh, I'll just take you. Take the high gold. Keep on moving. All right. So 88, 89, and 87. Like a lot of good stuff, but we are still looking for the big banger pull, man. I seen you guys the other day just pulling LTDs. I saw you guys pulling 92 full legends. That's what we're trying to see right now. We want to see something crazy like that. And these gold cards. That's what we like to see. We'll take all of y'all. Gold. Team of the week, man. What is it? 87 Kyler Murray, dude. Team of the weeks. Keep on doing your thing. That's what we like to see. Okay. Kyler Murray. Like to see that. I mean, some of those team of the week guys, 87s and 88s, do go for a little bit. So we'll have to check Kyler Murray and see if he's going for anything special. It's like we've had them for too long. I don't want to keep seeing these base elites, bro. All right. What do we got? Gold cards. We'll take y'all. Gold, gold, gold. Elite. I skipped over it. And you know what? I don't even care because I already know who the heck it was. It was my boy from the Bears Nation. Bear down, boys. Khalil Mack. Let's go. Okay. We'll take the Khalil Mack. I actually have another Khalil Mack on this account. That I'm just holding on to because I'm hoping that he gets the upgrade. Because have we got it? I guess we got I guess we got LT. But I was gonna say we haven't really got many outside linemen. I'm gonna hope that Khalil Mack gets the upgrade this part three because we are getting a part three. They already confirmed it in the stream. We saw that they came out with I forget who it was as a 90 though that they showed. So I'm hoping Khalil Mack gets an upgrade. I'm holding on to that Khalil Mack and the other one that I pulled just in case if they do. We just got a elite in the first round. Yes, sir. So we'll take you. Let's try and get a double elite. No double elite. It's all good, though. We got an elite in the first. We got a high gold there. That Khalil Mack, I think, is like 45-50K just because it's Khalil Mack. So it's actually a pretty good pull. Helps us out a lot. This might be one of those pro fantasy openings. I think we might be close to break even. We've gotten a lot of solid elites. It's what we like to see. I still think this is just the pack to go to. If you guys want to try and pull LTDs, any of that stuff... It's just you're not losing that much every time you pull it. And it can make it, if you get rid of all your cards, you can just keep re-rolling. That's kind of how I do it. 81 Christian Kirk. We got to make something happen. We got a lot of good pulls so far, but we still need to see some more. 
Come on. 542. Pro Fantasies. What we got? 68, 71, 66. Elite. Ooh, 86 Stefan Diggs. Okay, we'll take that. 86 overall Stefan. We'll take it. Not bad. Probably like a 30k pull. So double our coins pack. We needed something like that. So let's keep on moving. Man, we're getting to the end of the line here. But we have had a pretty solid opening. What? We've got in like 387s, 88, 89, right? See some Samuels luck really pop out at the end here. So many big banger pulls. LTDs, full legends. Heavyweights. I would take a heavyweight pull. Come on. Elite. 85 Michael Thomas. Team of the week. 81. Dang. A whole lot of animations right there. We'll take the Michael Thomas 85. I feel like I never see this Michael Thomas. I don't know. It just, it's odd. I don't know. It just bothers me. But one more pack left. Yeah, one more pack left. Let's open it up. Let's hope for something nice. Come on, man. Last pack magic. Power up. Kyle Pitts. Down to Hightower. Okay. Take all of you. Golds and silvers. Any elites? Legend. Oh my gosh. Last pack magic. Come on. 89 Jerry Rice. I don't care. I'll take it. I like that animation. It got me hyped up. It got me hyped up. Dang, man. It's all good though. 89 overall in the last pack magic, man. We do this sometimes, man. We have that last second luck. All right. Let's get it. So 289s on the opening. 88. I think 387s. A few 86s. I mean... We had a really good opening. I'm pretty sure we had to have gotten our coins back. So, got to level up. Do we have a pack? I don't think so. All right. 500k into the pro fantasies has taken a minute. Let's go to the binder. Let's see how many elites we pulled in 500k and let's add it all up. So, let's see, newest. Let's see, quality, elite. All right. So, got 5, 10, 15, 20. I think we started here. I think so. We got 20, 24 elites. That's not bad. 24 elites is what we like to see. So we'll start down at Cooper Cup. guys finished adding it up really good number we got 512k this is all after tax guys i have some things i want to show you so jerry rice going for a bit i put him in for 80k after taxes i'm gonna throw him up for 88 hope he sells for that i think he will just the way that that's looking um a lot of surprise things happen so khalil mack going for a really good price 55k i put him in for 50 after tax not bad at all but look at kyler murray bro so I put him in for 40K, but look what he has been selling for. This has potentially even go for more than what I'm saying. I said 40K after tax. The dude has been selling for 60. I said 40 after just because I saw this 46 and 47 and it sold like an hour ago. So I'm gonna put him in for 40, but that was actually a really big pull. Cam Newton as well, put him in for 73K because he was going for, I think in the 82-ish. Yeah, 82. So I put him in for 73. A lot of, I thought these were down bad. I don't know why I thought trading was down a lot worse than it was. Even this dude, bro, 38K, I put him in for 35. Not bad at all. We'll take that. A lot of good pulls. 512K after tax just on the elites. And last one, last but not least, CD Lamb. Going for 66 cap, put him for 60. So not bad at all there. I put all 80 to 82s in for 5K a pop. I put 84s in for 13, 85s in for 15. So I did really low ball numbers for my cards. So 512, that doesn't even include gold cards that we got, which we got a lot. I would say add the gold cards in. We probably have 600K on this opening. So really good pro fantasy opening. This just goes to show we had a really good opening, 289s. One, two, three, 87s, two 86s, a lot of good stuff. But now I could just sell all this stuff, do some exchanges, then re-roll and try and get an LTD, try and get a big banger pull. That's why I like the pro fantasy packs. And I'll be messing with these maybe tomorrow for rainbow LTDs. And then Friday, big 100K, most feared re-roll. Hopefully I get an LTD. But I'll see you guys then, man. It has been real. So make sure you guys hit the like button, hit the sub button, put it on post notifications, drop it down below. What pack are you guys going for if you want to pull an LTD in Madden 22? I'll see you on the next video, man. It has been real. Peace.